They asked me about a man named John McCain. He's not a war hero. He's a war hero. He's a war Five hero. and a half years. He's a war PW hero because he was captured. I like people that weren't captured, okay? I hate to tell you. Then he graduated last or second to last. He graduated last in his class at Annapolis. And he was upset. I said, why, for telling the truth? See, you're not supposed to say that somebody graduated last or second to last in their class. So I have to be honest, I've never liked them much. Hasn't been for me. I've really probably never will. I was very angry with John McCain because he killed health care. I was not a big fan of John McCain in any way, shape, or form. John McCain received a, a fake and phony dossier. Do you hear about the dossier? You said that you didn't think John McCain uh, was a hero, that you prefer people who don't get captured. Uh, in, in light of all that's happened since then um, and all you've learned, do you regret saying that? Is that something you wish you had not said? I, I, I say what I say, and uh, I never got along with John McCain. I disagreed with John McCain. You know that better than anybody, frankly. Uh, I wasn't a fan. McCain didn't get the job done for our great vets and the VA, and they knew it. That's why when I had my dispute with him, I had such incredible support. I'm Ravana, and welcome back to Rebel HQ. Several years after the death of former Senator John McCain, Donald Trump still can't stop talking about him. In a recent statement the former president put out, taking digs at the late senator's entirely unimpressive daughter, Meghan McCain, Trump said, At the request of many of her representatives, I made it possible for her father to have the world's longest funeral designed and orchestrated by him. In his own very special way, he was a rhino's rhino. Despite his fighting against me, I won Arizona by a lot in 2016 and won Arizona by even more in 2020. Trump actually got his ass handed to him by sleepy Joe Biden in Arizona in 2020, but that's neither here nor there. Now, don't get me wrong. John McCain is not a man who is above criticism. Far from it. The problem here is that Trump is not criticizing John McCain for the right reasons. McCain has many times used racist slurs when referring to Asian people. And who could forget this little bit of nonsense from the 2000s? presidential race. I got to ask you a question. I do not uh, believe in, I can't trust Obama. I, I, I have read about him and he's not, he's not, he's a, um, he's an Arab. He is not. No, 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 he's a, he's a, he's a decent family man. I don't know if you knew this, John, but Arab men can be decent family men too. John McCain also voted in favor of the Iraq War and the Patriot Act. He fought to repeal Roe v. Wade and believed that gay couples should not be able to adopt children. There's a lot here to criticize. But of course, Donald Trump's pea-sized brain couldn't land on a single salient point. 